first of four, it is Toy Distribution Day for the Salvation Army. Thousands of families are picking up Christmas presents donated through the Angel Tree program. Good Monday afternoon. It is great to see you. I'm Brian Dorman. And I'm Shannon Russo. The Salvation Army probably the happiest place to be in Tulsa today, one would think. News on 6's Mallory Thomas joins us live here at the top of four with a look at how the distribution is going so far. Mallory? Hi guys, well there is a lot of empty shelves here. They're emptying out quickly as the volunteers come. They grab the bags and then deliver them outside. But you can see we still have thousands of bags that are here. Families are gonna be picking up tomorrow. Jessica Nafee is 15 years old and this is her first time volunteering for the Salvation yeah. Army's Toy Distribution Day. Yeah, just, her favorite part is loading the Angel Tree gifts into the cars. I just feel it's good to help the community, like, see everyone so happy, help spread joy. It takes hundreds of volunteers and months of planning to make sure everything runs smoothly. Families began signing up for Christmas assistance in September. The number of families continued to grow right up to the deadline, and the final number was 6,200 angels, more than 400 over what they initially expected. So those children represent about 1,700 families today that um, the Salvation Army will impact. Major Sarah Nelson is the area commander for Salvation Army in Tulsa and says help from people and donors made sure no angel was left on the tree this year. Literally the last hours until the cutoff for adoption was was coming. I had a, a couple contact me and they wanted to know how many angel tags have not been adopted. The number at the time was about 400. She says the couple adopted all 400 angels and now families are picking up the donated gifts just in time for Christmas. Nice to see the people, uh, people's faces when, when they receive their thanks and, and they are so grateful. And along with the Angel Tree bags, each family gets a ham and they get a bag of potatoes and they also get a $100 gift card to Reesers to help with Christmas meals. Volunteers are wrapping up here for the day, but they'll start again tomorrow morning at 930. Live in Tulsa, Mallory Thomas, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6. All right, thank you, Mallory. So good to hear that couple adopted 400. That is absolutely incredible.